Hi, this is a, a follow-on to my review of uh, Chroma, made by Alpaca, um, who make the, the plug-in for Fertrop. So this is what you get when you open it, and I've used it a little bit more now, so I can I can uh, do some other interesting stuff. So this is what you get when you start, and I've just done their standard image and makes quite a nice drawing. But if you want to take it a little bit further, we'll get rid of that image, and we'll put in an imported image and we can scale and move this image around so we can scale it up we can rotate it here scale it in just generally scale it in the corners and stretch it by the side to sides and we'll put in a prompt a uh, just a basic description of what I want that should do it and then I'm going to stick in a, a load of stuff to make it all a bit fancy there we go and uh, I'll just do that on creative because we're we want to we want to make if you do pro it'll do more or less this again control would be a little bit more fancy creative will take this and take it somewhere else uh we'll see maybe that's too much but chrome is very 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 fast so it only takes a few seconds so there we go a very fancy haul so what we do we save that image off you click up here you can save a side by side or you can save the generated app and what we're going to do is put a figure in <laughs> so here we go um so uh figure as our perspective. I think we want our figure there, pretty much in the centre, far to the right. So what I'm going to do is erase where I want her to be. I'm making a hole. Essentially this is in painting. I want her about there. That looks about right. You can't unpaint, unfortunately. <laughs> but you can be quite crude. Okay, there's a rough lady. Now I don't want her big, so I will put her in uh, down a line uh, down here. So I shall put in uh, a lady, long dress, and we'll give her a smile to make her faceless and auburn hair again to make sure that we know she's important and then we'll go for that uh, and that's made a bit of the column drapery so uh, we'll run that through again that's done it again so we've got too much imagination so we'll drop the freedom a little bit and there we have one with the proper columns and everything so what we're going to do now is uh, refine her as you see as you see she's not very good so what we're going to do, we'll save her off first. I keep on forgetting to do that, which is a bad move. And then we'll delete this one. You can, Im you can import figures uh, over the top if you want, but we'll send that across to there. And then we're going to blow her up until she fills the frame, like so, a little bit more. And we'll promote her to the front of the prompt. I also want a little bit of decoration on her. So um, I'll, I'll, I'll do a little bit of uh, fancy on her dress and on the bodice here. Do this quite crudely. There we go. So then we'll iterate on that. And there she is. She's much nicer. So we'll save that off. So that's the dress and the hands and all that. That's all lovely. You see it's done the decoration on the dress. Then we'll get rid of that. Send that across. And then we're going to um, we're going to zoom in again to do her at about that size. And I don't much like her face. So uh, I'll have a look at it and see what it does. You can erase the face and it'll do a new one if you don't like it. That's quite good. The body's all better and hands better. So we'll have that one, but I still don't like the face. So what I'll do is raise the face. And there we go, much nicer face. So we we'll save that one. And then we get rid of this. You can see the process now. We get rid of this, send that cross, scale it. And now we want the final face. She's already pretty good, but we can, we can do better. There we go, look at that, very nice. We'll save that out. And then we will put all the bits together into Photoshop. And I'm going to use um, Alpaca to in upscale this. So there's a the big one. And then what we want to do is pick her out, paste her into there. So we've got so we've got all our bits and pieces in there. We'll put the first figure in place first. There she is. Then we do the upper body. That looks good. And uh, we'll put a layer mask around her, paint out her top. I think we've got a little bit of our, maybe not. That's all good. So that's all good. And uh, then we put a layer of mask around this as well. And I can join her on. And then finally, we'll put her, her new face on, like so. Get her roughly. Put a layer mask around, join her on. And there she is, a lovely hall with a beautiful lady in it, just like that. And there you go, very quick and easy. I think that's all I've got to say on the subject. Um, there's a, uh, show you, and that's about it. I'll show you another one I did. It's a little bit more extravagant, which was um, done with the whole. Uh, a lot of layers where I changed the colour slowly and then I laid them over the top. But I, this took about uh, 20 minutes and as you see it's pretty good. Okay, hope that's uh, interesting and fun. Thank you for watching.